Hey everybody, Shane at Solution One CrossFit. Uh, I had a conversation today during some dumbbell bench press about scapular retraction. So we're gonna talk about what that is and some easy ways to cue that up. The easiest way to talk about it is during a push-up. Uh, you guys are familiar with how to do push-ups. In a push-up position, it's not something that you really have to think about cueing, but you can see the shoulder blades and how they move. The easiest way to see it, if you look right down on top of someone's shoulder blades when they're doing push-ups, the downward movement from an extended arm starts from those shoulder blades. So you can see as I drop down, the blades are pinching together, and that starts the movement. The same as you come up, the final lockout as you push away from the floor separates those blades. So I will use that as a warm up sometimes before a bench press to get the shoulder blades loosened up. Now the reason that is important is when you go to a bench press, especially on a dumbbell bench press, most people lose control of the dumbbells because they do not pull down. So right now I'm in an extended position and before I start in the set, you're gonna see me lock those down the same way you saw me locking my blades together. So once I get set, I'm gonna pull myself into position and pull the dumbbells down before I press up again, trying not to lose that, dumb, uh, that pinch between the blades. That gives you the control to pull down and your lats will also unload on the way up. So if that's something you've never done before, never played with that, try the push-up position. You can get a, a hand between the shoulder blades to cue it, and then move on to a press and see if you can figure out how to transition into pulling the dumbbells down. See if that helps your bench press. Uh, again, Shane, it's Solution One CrossFit. Thanks, guys.